Hi, I'm getting ready to watch the trailer for Airlift, which is Akshay Kumar's new movie. I'm not sure how I feel about this because I feel like I've been going through some hard times with Akshay Kumar. I love Akshay Kumar, and he does great comedies, and he does great action movies, but I feel like I've been watching a lot of tragedies because in the last decade, I've suffered through some Akshay Kumar movies. Suffered. Oh, like I like to say, the best thing about an Akshay Kumar movie is Akshay Kumar. Because he is a good actor, and I love his energy. I love what he brings to a film. It's just sometimes that film doesn't help him out. It's not backing him. But I'm about to find out about this one. I'm hoping that this movie plays in my city. Here, we only have one movie theater that plays Indian movies. Use it's about one or two at a time. So I'm not sure if they're going to show this next. I believe they are. And this would be my first actual Kumar movie in theater. So, I'm excited about that, but to be honest, I'm not super excited about this movie. It, I'm kind of scared. I just hope it's a good action movie, which is what I think it is. So, here I go. And play. Okay, T series. Hello, Ministry of External Affairs. जी मैं कोयत से रंजीत कटियाल बोल रहा हूँ जी मुझे कोयत में रहे इंडियंस के सिचुएशन के बारे में बात करनी थी वी नीड हेल्प एंड वी नीड इट दिस इज लाइक एक्शन ड्रामा Uh -oh. Is there a movie in which he goes and he can't get he can't get out? All I understand with Dosti, it's some kind of friend. Social one may let go. The first down is Mr. Rajit. One man, Sunny D or Om for actually come on to this movie. They cannot get out. That's his love interest. Not love interest, or it might be his wife. I have to look her up. And his life. Are they dead or knocked out? Or? They're probably dead. He's Thank you for giving me some English. Actually, come on. Oh, he just sent me Republic Day is coming up. Maybe that's why this movie is coming out now. She's patriotic. Oh, this Republic Day. Okay. Feel proud. I'm sorry. To be an Indian. Pepe Dilhe Industani. Pepe Dilhe Industani. Once again. Gayal. Oh, it's a different movie. I'm sorry. Air lift. He needs to be lifted out of the situation. Bye bye, air. Okay, I don't know that name. I forgot to look up the director. I felt it. Just a little bit. Okay. Alrighty. So he's, I don't know who he is, but he gets put in a situation, he's stuck in there, he can't get out. But it's not like a race against the clock. It's not like a, it's not like a, you know what I mean? It felt, even though it's uh, a serious situation, it's deadly, it didn't have that deadly feeling, if you know what I'm saying. You probably don't know what I'm saying. I, I probably don't know what I'm saying. It felt more dramatic than action-packed. Does that make sense? It wasn't like a dance ball we see clear, um, car chases, and you see guns, and you see him fighting with something. Did he, it, it, no scene did he have a gun. Not one scene. I guess it's not that kind of a movie. We're going to use more talking rather than letting the gun speak for itself. But... It feels, I'd probably be more action-packed. It's a drama. That's what it is, a drama. 
And there's nothing wrong with that drama. It can be good. What's going to save that is a good storyline, which it seems pretty good. It seems like a good plot anyway. And it, de it needs good dialogue because that movie looked like a whole bunch of talking. It had a whole bunch more talking than I expected. I thought it would be loud music and just fast scenes, quick scenes. That's what I expected from an alien. But I was wrong. It was a lot of, um, okay, we're going to stand. And I actually, come on, going to deliver this dialogue in the supermarket. He's going to deliver this dialogue in the office. He's going to deliver this dialogue while drinking this little tea. Um, mm -hmm, it was, it was. And so, I don't know how I feel about this. I think it can be a good movie. But I'm thinking about it in that, this aspect. I'm not in a hurry to see it. I'm sorry. I'm not in a hurry to see this movie and really I was planning to go and see it in theaters and I'm not that excited it's not like I don't think the movie is going to be good it's just off of the concept that it's bringing me I'm not excited to go see it you know what I mean I love the movie this is not a good example like I'm trying to think of a good example I'm thinking of a Hindi movie I don't watch a lot of American films my mind went to Dead Poet Society I love that movie that movie is good to me but it, and it's really sad, I, but I don't get excited to go watch Dead Poets Society. I know I'm in for something good, but I don't get excited to see it. This movie, I'm not excited to see. It doesn't mean I don't think it's going to be good. I'm just not excited to go see it. I'm not excited to go sit in a cold theater with it playing loudly in my ear. I'm not excited. I can actually wait to see this. Maybe I can wait until like um, Independence Day. Can I wait till then? Do, I don't need to see it Republic Day. I can wait a little while. Just a little while. That's all I'm saying. And so, uh, I don't know. <sighs> Here's how I messed up my mind. Because last year, I had a baby, but I loved Singers Bling. Which is really weird anyway, because, I don't know. I like Singers Bling. You can't judge me for that. I know. Hate me. Judge me. It's honesty. Bye.